All right, that's it. Is this a pattern with your mom? One that I've had to put up with for a very long time. You know, I spent most of my life trying to protect her from these impulses. But I guess it's time to start looking out for myself. That's just how she operates, right? Yeah, to tell she operates. But she's not she's not selfish. She's reckless. She doesn't see the consequences, you know? She it's what she wants, whenever she wants it, and how she's gonna get it. Gee, I wonder what a woman like that would see in Uncle Bill. <laughs> she told me once that they're more alike than they wanted to admit. Yeah, but you're nothing like that. What changed me, Caroline? She showed me the value in honesty, the beauty in, in a thing done right for the right reasons. You know, those are, those are lessons that I never really grew up with. And I hope just, she doesn't just see the best in people. She brings it out in them. She brought it out in me. But my mother is still my mother. And hope's had enough of the both of us. That doesn't seem fair. <laughs> I told her. I told her that this thing with Dad would be dangerous. You knew? About her feelings for Dad? Yeah. I told her to be careful that someone could get hurt. Like Ridge and his family. And she knew what was at stake. Our work with Forrester, my relationship with Hope. But it didn't matter. This is no such thing as enough in her vocabulary. And then I told her about the, what happened with Hope, and, and she was like, no, don't worry, baby, I'll fix it. You told her no. I doubt she'd listened. You don't seem that concerned. I would be, but honestly, I can't possibly see how this could get any worse. <laughs>